customer service. In this bite-sized course, we will discuss why do we need to treat customers well, what customers expect from us, what is superior customer service, and how to handle difficult customer, and how to manage yourself. Why do we need to treat the customers well? They are our bread and butter. They are the reason for my job. They are the reason the company exists. What is superior customer service? Providing services in a way which delights the customer is good customer service. Service that exceeds customer expectation and makes you stand out from rest of the competitors. Service that makes the customer to visit again and again. What does the customer expect from us? We listen to him. Understand his needs or problem. Acknowledge his problem. Provide solutions. Provide precise and accurate information. Act quickly. Caring attitude. Qualities required for excellent customer service. Good knowledge of the product or services offered. Listening abilities. Question or probing techniques. Caring attitude. Quick thinking. Speedy and timely resolution of complaints. Service with a smile. Quality customer service relies on good agent, so it is important that the agent possesses the right attributes and qualities to deliver exceptional customer experience. A good agent is one who has the right mix of head and a heart. One who enjoys his work and has the right attitude towards life. Of all the qualities, attitude is the most important one. Attitude is the way we perceive things and situations in our life. It is the reactive nature of an individual towards life situations. Attitude could be positive as well as negative. It is necessary to show a positive attitude while dealing with customers. Positive attitude brings confidence and energy into a person. Positive attitude helps a person to cope stress and problems in a better way. Always be positive and enthusiastic. Smile, be friendly and positive. Your attitude is going to mirrored back by the customer. A bad mood or a bad day could be taken care of by right attitude. Customer doesn't care if you had a bad day. Leave your problem at home. Customers expect you delight him by your services. Greet the customer with a smile. Use the last name to address them prefixed by Mr., Ms., or Mrs. Don't use their first name unless asked to. You should sound energetic and confident. Compliment them for any special feature visible for example a nice tie, watch, decorated office, nice voice etc. Be a good listener. Identify and anticipate needs. Make customer feel important and appreciated. Make customer understand your product and system. Be ready to help. Listen to their requirements. Provide appropriate suggestions. Be alert keep an eye on customer choice and preferences. Apologize when things go wrong. Give more than expected. Get regular feedback. Thank the customer for their visit. Apologize. An apology makes the angry customer feel heard and understood. It diffuses anger and allows to establish trust. Diplomacy and Empathy Use carefully worded sentences and phrases to kill the anger brewing in them like, Getting to the bottom of this issue is as much important me as it is to you, or, I am sorry to hear that. Responsibility Acknowledge the deficiency in the service. Commit to them that you will take care of the issue or investigate the matter personally and will call back within a required time frame. Computer mode. If the customer is still angry and irate then get into computer mode. Computer mode is unemotional neutral. This forces the customer to stop right in their tracks as you don't fall into the emotional trap and it helps you to regain control. 
assertive, if the situation further escalates or the customers gets abusive get assertive ask, have I personally done something to harm you, I am here to help, if you don't want that, then call me when you need me. Appreciate, show appreciation for the feedback. Thank the customer for his patience. Welcome customer complaints. Managing yourself, do not return anger with anger. Remember customer has nothing personal against you he is reacting to the deficiency in service. Don't get emotional. Don't react respond. Keep control of situations. Apologize whenever required. Be calm and composed always.